Developing tonight, witnesses and police say a man rammed into his girlfriend's car, causing a chain reaction crash that killed an innocent driver. Police say the couple's fight possibly crossed county lines, starting in Orange County and ending in Osceola. And that is where we find News 6's Jerry Askin. He is live at the Osceola County Jail tonight. And Jerry, you found out the victim worked as a nurse at Osceola Regional Hospital? Ginger, yes, so sad. And I'm also finding out she was a working mother, working mother who loved her family and sadly leaves two small kids behind. Uh, she was riding in the car alone when that crash happened, an innocent bystander. And right now we're finding out the man accused in causing that crash is sitting behind bars right here in the Osceola County Jail on bond. She was a very, very happy girl. Very, very. She didn't deserve to die, especially like that. Jose Keeleys is still trying to understand why. His niece, 30-year-old Jacinia Keeley's Reyes, was killed Friday when St. Cloud police say this man, Andrick Barksdale, got upset with his girlfriend, followed her, then rammed his girlfriend's car, causing a chain reaction crash. In all, five cars were involved. Jacinia Reyes sadly died on scene. Her uncle told me she had so much promise. She likes to work with people. That's the reason why she is a nurse, you know. She likes to save people, let's put it that way. Her uncle saying she worked at Osceola Regional Medical Center. She had two small boys and she loved her family. I still see her smile, you know. And uh, she, uh, she gonna be missed. Andrick Barksdale faced the judge over the weekend. Right now we're still working to find out why Barksdale and his girlfriend were arguing. Rosemary Lazala saw the crash scene over the weekend and can't believe her neighbor is now dead. He put on, on other people in jeopardy, and look what happened. You know, very, very sad situation. Yes, back live here in Osceola County, Bartsdale now sitting behind bars here on bond. He's charged with vehicle manslaughter, aggravated battery, and he's also now facing a stalking charge. So we're working to find out more about that new stalking charge. As for Yesenia Keeley's Reyes, who died in that crash, her uncle told me her two kids are now staying with their grandmother. And coming up here all new at 5, I spoke with her uncle, and he has a few words for Bartsdale, who's now sitting uh, behind bars here in Osceola County. I'll tell you what he had to say in the next hour. We're live in Osceola County. I'm Jerry Askin, getting results, new six. Just tragic. Jerry, thank you.